As the sun began to set over Antarctica, the great British explorer Ernest Shackleton could feel a deathly chill setting in. He had been leading an expedition of 28 brave men with a mission to cross the Antarctic continent by foot. A feat that had never been achieved at the time. But now they shipped the endurance was stuck in the ice and they found themselves stranded, hundreds of miles away from civilization, with no hope of rescue or communication with the outside world. For weeks, Shackleton and his crew endured freezing temperatures and scarce resources as they camped and planned for a way out. Shackleton knew he had to take action. Doing nothing was not an option. He decided that if anyone was going to survive this ordeal alive and make it back home safely, he would need to risk it all and attempt to get help. He would need a small crew who could help him sail away from Antarctica, leaving behind the camp with the rest of the men. Shackleton may have lost his ship, but he was now determined not to lose the lives of his men. Shackleton decided to take the strongest of the lifeboats they had brought on board, otherwise known as the James Caird, and sail across treacherous seas towards South Georgia Island, where rescue would be waiting for them. If they could make it that far, despite warnings about how dangerous such an undertaking would be, and most considering it a suicide mission, Shackleton was determined not to give up hope. He chose five loyal men for this mission. Frank Worsley, the captain, Tom Crean, the navigator, Timothy McCarthy, a carpenter, John Vincent, a seaman, and Lionel Greenstreet, another seaman. With no navigational aids or charts available, they sailed 800 miles through some of the most dangerous waters imaginable, braving icebergs bigger than mountains and strong winds that threatened to capsize them at any moment. Finally, they reached South Georgia Island after 16 deadly days at sea. The small crew of six men miraculously arrived and harmed, but all were exhausted beyond belief. But their ordeal was not over yet. Shackleton then led a grueling 36-hour long hike across snow-covered mountains until his team eventually reached safety, something which seemed impossible only weeks ago. It had seemed impossible, but courage guided them forward. After rescuing three more members left behind back on Elephant Island, he took everyone aboard another expedition ship bound for England, where everyone finally and joyfully were reunited with family and friends alike. This remarkable story is a testament to Shackleton's tenacity and leadership skills. Not only did he save every single one of his men's lives, but he also provided a lasting insight into the human spirit and its never-ending capacity for survival. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.